that's going to push through all of these showers, but like I said, things will start to become a little bit more spotty in the afternoon time as that quickly moves off to the east. And then high pressure will build back in and we'll see some drier weather for the end of the week and into the weekend. So just tracking everything out on future tracker, some rain showers throughout the morning time. And this will continue all throughout the morning hours. So plan on just driving carefully. Around lunchtime, temperatures will be pretty stagnant in the upper 60s. And we're going to be seeing the clouds all throughout the day. And then the chances for those showers become a little bit more spotty in the upper 60s for that high temperature, low 70s in some areas. The spotty showers do continue into the evening. That cold front will move off. Things will be cleared up by tomorrow morning where those temperatures will be in the mid 40s to start your day and then will be dry all throughout tomorrow. Just seeing some scattered clouds we do have some cool air moving off the lake and then temperatures will be in the low 60s for that afternoon high. Mostly clear overnight into Friday. Friday morning temperatures will start in the upper 30s. So future rainfall expected from this system less than a half of an inch of rainfall. So a little bit of a good of amount, but our area really needs it as we are really dry. High temperature today is 70 degrees. The scattered showers throughout the morning time. There's just a chance for just a rumble of thunder. And then it will be windy too. Winds coming out of the southwest 5 to 15 miles per hour, possibly gusting up to 25. Tonight will be 47. Will be mostly cloudy. It's just a chance for a sprinkle or an isolated shower. But tomorrow things will be cleared up. Will be dry. Seeing the scattered clouds, 60 degrees is the high temperature. And for the rest of the seven-day forecast, things will be dry for us to end the week and go into the weekend. Partly sunny for Friday and Saturday. We'll be in the low 60s, too. And then the normal for this time of year is in the low 50s. So still seeing some above normal temperatures in the extended day. Next chances for rain will be Sunday as another weather system comes through. We'll see some rain showers throughout the day. And then the rain showers will go into Monday morning and we'll be in the low 60s to begin next.